friends, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to talk about, well, Disney, <laughs> obviously. I don't know if you guys remember, but about a month before I went on my college program, I made a bucket list of all the things that I wanted to do while I was on the college program. A lot of you have asked how I went with my bucket list and if I completed everything, how I went, what did I um, actually have on it. So I thought I would do kind of a DCP bucket list video going through everything that I completed on the list. I'm really glad I, I wrote a bucket list before I went because when you're on the college program, time just goes so quickly. Like while you're there in the moment and you're in the parks every day working so hard, it like time just flies and the weeks just all merge together. And it was so good that I had a bucket list kind of kept me on track to like do all the things that I wanted to do. So yes. Um, jump right into my bucket. Number one, meet Mickey and Minnie. <laughs> she's nervous, but she's so excited. Number two, reenact my baby photo with Goofy. It's my 97 autograph book that I got the first time I went to Disney World with my mom. I was only a baby, I was only like, I was tiny. Um, so we met all the, um, the Fab Five, and that was cool, except for the one with Goofy. I, for some reason, I just, <laughs> I was terrified of- I'm just about to reenact this. Do you reckon I can get that face? <laughs> Kingdom, Epcot, um, Animal Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, Blizzard Beach, and Typhoon Lagoon. Try the gray stuff at Be Our Guest. It is time to try the, the gray, gray stuff! stuff. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Mail a letter from inside Magic Kingdom. <laughs> Stay at a Disney Resort. Have a collection of Disney pins. Yeah, I didn't want to get too many, but once you start pin trading as a merchandise cast member and you're trading all the time and you see really cool pins, you kind of, yeah, get a little obsessed. Watch the fireworks from Main Street. Okay, so I watched that a couple of hundred times. And cried. Basically every single time. The fireworks are about to start! We're so excited! <laughs> completely surround- oh, it was so cool. Visit Pandora and ride Flight of Passage. Find a hidden Mickey. Get an annual pass to Universal Studios. Would definitely recommend getting an annual pass. It's just a nice way to kind of like get out of the Disney bubble but not quite out of the theme park bubble and go on some crazy cool rides like the Incredible Hulk. Guys, we're here! Yes, we made it! So exciting! Oh, it gets me every time. Oh my gosh, look at it. Trying Butterbeer for the first time! I'm so excited, girl! So good. Oh wow! It's so sweet. It's oh, so good. I love it. Oh my God. <laughs> it's bigger than your face. <laughs> it's like five of your faces combined. Food and wine 
festival at Epcot that was delicious. Oh, some marinated chicken with peanut sauce. Thank you. Australia! Make a wish in Snow White's Wishing Well. Make a wish. <laughs> I just did the same thing. Where did it go? I found the shiny piece. Okay. Gentle, gentle. Okay. Did it sing? It's like very soft. I thought it sang. Is it Snow White? I thought this one sang. I forgot to make a wish. You forgot to what? <laughs> I was concentrating so hard. Make a magical moment for a guest. Ride the Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Oh. I think it was actually the last ride that I rode on my college program. Oh, that's so magical. <laughs> Are you excited, Lucy? I'm excited. Oh. Do the Four Parks in One Day Challenge. I think I did this like four or five times on my college program. <laughs> How do you feel? First, uh, um... Thing. First experience of doing four parks in one day. Ah, accomplished. You feel accomplished? You feel like it's a defeatable challenge? I do feel like it's a defeatable yes. challenge. Yes. Attempt to ride all the attractions in one day. I only attempted this once. It was like just after Hurricane Irma, so the parks were really quiet and it was a really good time. Like the ride, the lines were like, they weren't long at all. But I think we did 26 out of the, at that stage when I did it, it was 52 rides we had to do and we did 26. So we got halfway there. I definitely think it's possible, but I didn't attempt it again because I was so exhausted by the end. Try a cinnamon roll from Gaston's Tavern. I think the cinnamon roll at Gaston's Tavern is the best value snack that you can buy at Disney. It's like ginormous. <laughs> oh my gosh, so I didn't have breakfast, so I'm going to have cinnamon roll. Cinnamon Nutritious. <laughs> two photos in front of the castle. You ready? Try sodas from around the world at Epcot. I try the waffles at Sleepy Hollow. Oh my gosh, I love the waffles at Sleepy Hollow. They are so good. They're like Nutella and fresh fruit and oh, so good. So um, today on Jess's vlog we have two different options of waffles. Mm. Uh, we have one option of spicy chicken waffles with mm. a cold slaw on a nice crisp waffle. And waffle? over <laughs> waffle, yeah. And over here um, on Jess's plate we do have a waffle with a Nutella base with strawberries and vanilla. Oh, that's what I'm talking, talking about. about. Um, try Foo's brew. Spot a celebrity. I was so worried that I wouldn't see a celebrity while I was there, but but I saw um, when they were doing the holiday filming. I saw Raven Simone. It was so cool. I saw her I think twice. Once backstage while I was walking and I was like, oh my gosh, Raven Simone. And then one when I was on the floor working. She was in line to come to my register. She was so close and I was just going to be like, thanks guys. Acting all cool, you know, because you can't be like all crazy when you're on the clock. But she went to the register next to me. <laughs> I was like, close to serving Raven Simone. Uh, get my tradition's ears embroidered. Right, the characters in Flight Balloon at Disney Springs. Okay. Wowzers, that is huge. <laughs> Alright, here we are at the top of the balloon at Disney Springs. Woo! Princesses meet a rare character. Not so. He gives really good hugs, and I don't remember if he smelled like strawberries or not. Buy a Mickey and Minnie plush. Yeah, I'm gonna make a Disney haul video, and we can go through all of the plush that I bought. Then <laughs> buy a Christmas ornament. This is my favorite ornament that I bought. It's got Mickey and it's got the castle, and it's just really cute. Get a picture at every Disney wall. So my favorite Disney walls were the purple wall, what would you want? The purple wall, bubblegum wall, toothpaste wall, and the you are so beautiful wall. Try a Mickey pretzel. You know, actually not a fan. Bottomless milkshakes at the Plaza restaurant. Meet Gaston. He is like, I remember the first time I met Gaston. I was so scared, like, cause he got, he was like really intimidating. He was like, hello ladies, and he was like, really close and I was like, uh, 
Bride Space Mountain with the lights on. Space Mountain with the lights on was so, so cool. fun. Oh my god. It's been on my bucket list for so long and I was worried I wouldn't get to do it. But what? ticked it off today. Do a backstage tour. So besides Space Mountain with the lights on, I did a backstage tour of Dinosaur at Animal Kingdom. That ride scares me so much. Even though I I walked the track, I know where all the jump scares are, I know how it all works, it still terrifies me. Like I go on that ride and I go, I shut the whole time and go. <laughs> Watch the candlelight procession at Epcot. <laughs> Festival of the Arts at Epcot and the Flower and Garden Festival trying the Violet Lemonade. It's actually really, really yummy. Fill up a memory box. So at um, the Disney graduation they give, give you a memory box. And I have a lot more stuff than what is in here, but it's just such a super cute way to like keep your little memories in. Oh, I love it. Have my best friend Jess come visit and have a best friend day at Disney. She visited me after Christmas and we had so much fun. I loved showing her all my favorite things. So it's my day off and guess who's with me? <laughs> Are your ears hurting already, Jess? A little. Hurting your brains? Just Little, you know, oh little in my noggin. I've got indents in my brain. I know. From my ears. Because you wear them every day. <laughs> Snack. Snack. <laughs> Try a pineapple doll whip. <gasps> One of my favorite ice creams ever. This is incredible. It's so. It's so. <gasps> Try a turkey leg. I only tried this the once. And man, <laughs> pretty sure it's not turkey. I'm not sure what it is, but I don't think it's turkey. First ever turkey leg day. All right, moment of truth. Eat it, Peter. Okay. It tastes like turkey. It's good. Oh my gosh! Oh, it's yeah. heavy. <laughs> Okay, so fireworks have just started. I hope, 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 hope we, I can tick this off my bucket list and we can see the fireworks from while we're riding Thunder Mountain. <gasps> Fingers crossed, can we do it? I really, really hope so. How good was that breakfast? Oh, the bread. It's like pineapple -y goodness. Oh, I ate like five pieces. Fill up my journal. I did, I, well, I didn't fill it all the way, but I, I tried to write in it as much as I could to document all my memories. I'm so glad that I documented all my adventures, like by vlogging and by writing them down. Because everything, like, it just all merges together. So definitely, if you're going on the college program, find some way to document all your adventures so you can really have something to look back on. Become a wilderness explorer at Animal Kingdom. All guys, are you right. excited? If you guys would yes. please join me in the middle of the road here. And let our friends pass by. What is this? All right. Oh, okay. so great. And since you don't have a book, can you wave this very high and yes. for me? Absolutely. Attention Animal Kingdom!
We did it. We did it. Oh, oh what a gosh. day. Such a day. Look I at this so badge proud. though. Yeah. Look. Senior Wilderness I'm Explorer very Studio. exhausted. That was um, a lot, but I'm excited. The sorcerers of the Magic Kingdom can do this game where you go around the um, Magic Kingdom and you have to do all these different quests. It was, it was good. It was a good way to fill in some time one day. Okay. What did I do with this? Why isn't it going back together? Alright, we're gonna go this way. I think I'll use my Buzz Lightyear. Good job! I did it! You freed the dogs! Yes. Buy cast member merchandise. There's um Company D, which is a special cast member only shop, and then Cast Connections, which is where all the rejected merchandise, old um, and damaged merchandise goes, and cast members get it for super cheap. Very, very handy. Sketch on the hub grass. The Hubgrass was like my favourite place in the whole park. See the Dapper Dan sing? The Dapper Dan's actually sang to me on my birthday and it was so cute. I love the Dapper Dan's. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday dear Jessica. Happy birthday to you. Go to Starlet Splash. So housing actually puts on a bunch of events while on the college program. I wish I went to more, but you kind of just run out of time. But definitely go to Starlet Splash. It's the biggest event for the year. They, they hire out the whole Typhoon Lagoon. So all the college program kids, we get it for the whole night. Ice cream! Ice cream! Ice cream! glows in the dark and it is super cool. See the surprise hoe down in Frontierland? It's like a flash mob. You don't you don't know the timings that happen, but as a cast member you kind of have ways to know when things are gonna happen. So <laughs> See someone pull the sword from the stone. See a custodial cast member do water art. <laughs> Have a Disney sticker collection. Almost as fun as collecting Disney pins. But eat the sand pail from Typhoon Lagoon. You guys excited for the sand pail? Woo! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Thank you. Yeah. This is just for me. What are you guys having? <laughs> Go to Disneyland in LA. I ride Summit Plummet. Oh my gosh. Summit Plummet. I think it's at Blizzard Beach. And it is 
the most painful water slide ever. It's like nearly vertical and you gotta like hold yourself for dear life as you go down and the water's like bashing you. <laughs> Definitely put on your bucket list, but just a warning, it hurts. Learn all the words to move it, shake it. So this is a parade that happens, I think they're getting rid of it, but it's a parade that happens I think three times during the day. And I just love, I love it. And there's a song right at the end, it's like, it was my goal to learn all the words by the end of my program. And I did. And it's like one of my most proudest DCP achievements. I'm so excited! Gabby, it's our last movement, shake it together! Ready to party up? I'm ready to party. Let's do it! Hey, I'm moving like this! I can shake it like this! to find the treasure! Arr. Oh, where are we going, Gabby? Can you read the map? I don't know, I can't read. <laughs> Ride the lazy river. Oh, the water park, the lazy river is like my favorite thing ever. See the trolley show in every season. So <laughs> I was really, really worried that I wouldn't see a character palooza while I was there because you just don't know when they're going to happen and it's completely random. But luck of the draw, me and my friend Gabby, we were just like walking through Epcot and then suddenly we're walking past Canada and the, these like doors just randomly open and all these characters come out and we're like, Hello. Gabby, I think we just walked into a character palooza. I think we did. Oh, oh, look, look, Chip and Dale. Oh, can we meet Rafiki and Pinocchio? Get pixie dusted. This one can we go with? With a little faith, trust, and pixie dust. All your dreams and wishes come true. Thank you! Welcome. Press a penny. Like this. Oh, it tells me. Okay. Push it in. All the way. You can do it. Push. Are you not like? It's jammed. Ah! But I want Mickey! <laughs> okay. Take two. Until next time. This one is gonna work. Take two. <laughs> turned on and we were like stuck and the door thing was open and we were like oh my gosh what is happening go to mickey's not so scary halloween party and like halloween's not a thing in australia so it was kind of cool to have like an american disney halloween <laughs> Merry Christmas party. 
party and try eggnog. Snowing on Main Street and it was magical and it was just... Mm. And eggnog is actually really good. Okay team, I think we're ready for the Christmas party. Are you I guys? Think we are I think we're underdressed. Underdressed? Yeah. Are you a bit underdressed? Just a tad. I think I should have gone bigger. Bigger or go more festive. Big I showed you before, this is my 1997 autograph book, and when I went in 1997, I think I, I've got five characters that I met, and so my goal was to fill the rest up. And so that's what I did. It took me nearly my whole college program. But I'm so proud of this. This is one of my, like, most special Disney college program possessions. Eat a Mickey ice cream bar. You know, I may have had one or two hundred. Mickey ice cream bars in my college program. What time is it, Gabby? Ice cream time! <laughs> Play mini golf. I think I did the uh, winter summer land one. Super fun. I suck at mini golf, but it was so fun. Alright, here we go. Oh, that was really bad. Ah! Oh no! It came back. <laughs> that was my practice run. Practice, it's fine. Okay, take two, take two. Take two! Stay! Oh, just an inch in the bushes. <laughs> I'm really good at this. Find a Main Street USA pin. So a lot of the older cast members at um, in the Emporium have the, well, like would wear these pins with their costume. We call it the Main Street USA pin. I don't know if it's like a fake one or a real one or whatever, but it was like my goal to find one and trade and get it. And it was like so lucky. I was so excited when I got it. Mm. Eat the kitchen sink. OMG, <laughs> the kitchen sink is ginormous. There was eight of us, I think we did it for my birthday, there was eight of us eating it and we only just made it through, but it was, it was so cool. Definitely put this on your bucket list, it's wild. Take a selfie with a character. Fill an Epcot passport. So this is where you go around to all the kid cut areas and you can fill up your um, your passport and talk to all the different people from the different, all the cast members from the different countries. It was really cool. Be at Magic Kingdom from Rope Drop to Kiss Goodnight. I actually did this on my very last day as, on the college program. It was so sad, but it was so cool to be there from Rope Drop when the park opens all the way to the Kiss Goodnight when the park closes. Oh. With the magic words, on the count of three, we're all going to say, Bibbidi, Bobbidi, Boo. Here we go. tradition for when it's your last shift working at the Emporium, you get to go out onto Empty Main Street and get a picture in your costume. And it's like a really magical kind of like goodbye. Turn my ears and graduate from the DCP. <laughs> what a catch! <laughs> sobbed so much on <laughs> my last day of the college program. 
and it, as soon as the fireworks started, it was like, dun, 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 and I was like, I was gone. And then I went and saw Mickey to say goodbye, and I was like, hi, Mickey. <laughs> the waterworks just, they did not stop. They started flowing and they did not stop. <laughs> Well, Walt Disney World, thank you for all the magic. It's been, it's been incredible. Those are everything that I completed on my bucket list. What I didn't complete, I think it was six things actually. Eating at Cinderella's Royal Table, so expensive, but it was on my bucket list. I wanted to try it. Didn't get to, but next time definitely. Go on a Disney cruise, same thing, trying to get time off and trying to afford to go. Tricky, but definitely on my bucket list to go on it one day and perhaps even work on a Disney cruise one day. That's the dream. I'll write a weekly postcard of my adventures, yeah. It was like, a really cool Pinterest idea, but it just didn't end up happening. But I documented it by vlogging, taking pictures, and I was writing my journal, so... Yeah. Pick up at another location. I didn't get to do that, actually. I'm surprised. But I just love the Emporium so much that I just... I didn't want to pick up anywhere else. But I think I would have liked to pick up in Fantasyland, where you can, like, pixie dust princesses, and you're all surrounded by the royalty and everything. But, yeah. I, it's not a huge regret, but I kind of wish I did. And I also didn't... This was like, I knew it was never going to happen, but you never know the magic that might happen. See the royal suite in the castle. Yeah, I didn't make it up there this time. Maybe one day. So that was 100 things on my Disney College program bucket list, where I completed, I believe, 94 things. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so I completed 94 out of 100 things on my bucket list. So I'm super stoked. I'm super proud of that. But if you're heading on the college program, definitely would recommend writing yourself a bucket list so you can kind of make sure you get everything that you want to do done while you're on the college program. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love, obviously, you can tell that I can just get so excited talking about Disney. So um, I love sharing my bucket list with you and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a magical day, guys. Bye.